Do you like to sometimes give cash in your cards? Today we're gonna to look at a really cool way to package your money cards. So let's get started. You know, in the past I've shown some other slimline cards and I'll connect to a playlist with these. So this is a way to attach a gift card. And then these were just some others. It's Karen Titus stamping on the back porch. And today we're gonna to add one little tweak that will make your cards a cash holder. So here we have, and of course, I like to just decorate regular envelopes, decorate the top. Here's a fun little birthday card. It's time to celebrate, you party animal. And look inside, we've got the little cash. So we've got this fun little pocket. So that's what we'll do today. So to make these, I'm starting with an eight and a half by nine inch. Um, piece of cardstock. So I'm going to put the eight and a half, the nine inch is going to go along here. I'm going to do the eight and a half right along here, and I'm going to score it at three and a half and at seven. Now, just a quick reminder I'm going to fold this over. The regular cards, the slimline cards, are just nine by seven. So you see this is where it's cut off. I have just left this all the way to eight and a half so that, check that out. When we fold it up, we have the little lip on the bottom. Okay, so I'm gonna make this as a little Christmas holder. So I am using for this, this uh, flocked poinsettia paper, which is just gorgeous. I'm going to use my silicone pad here and I'm going to put some multi-purpose glue in the corner and now when I use my sponge on the back of this to hold it down what's really awesome is this is going to dry without showing any glue just have to put this the way I want it now I could wrap ribbon around this. I'm doing this as a gift, as you can see. So it's gonna look like a package. But I, this is just a little easier and quicker and just another way instead of doing, packing the ribbon. This is just gonna be my pretty paper. I'll put this on. I need a little bit more glue here and I'll do my two small pieces. Uh, slide that over whoop hold that a second till it gets on there okay I'll do Tim's pounding he always likes to pound his his things here to okay so we'll set that aside and then I have this I have the pretty point set I already done. This is gonna be my package bow, and this is going to be a little Merry Christmas on the side here. So we'll put this on so you can see how easily this all comes together. This oh I'll put up like this because it's kind of like my package tie. And on this, I'm gonna put a few glue dots. If I can get them to stick here. Pressing them on, they're just not wanting to stick. I don't know why. Ooh, and I forgot my pretty little, um, I'm going to add that pretty little, the pearls that go in the middle, that really fancy thing. So if you look afterwards on my Uh, blog. I always attach that here. You'll see a photo of it totally finished, but for now we'll just finish this. So here is the front of my card. Isn't that fun? It just looks like a package. And then here I'm going to take a one inch strip by eight and three quarters since this is nine inches. I'm just going to decorate that. So it's just a little bit right there. And then I have my 
inside right here and I just put the words high enough to do that and I'm going to take some tear and tape to put right on the sides here to make this little pocket. When I take this off, and push that up. I have a pretty inside too in there. I'll put my cash. And there is the top. And then here is a birthday one. I'm just gonna fold it one more time. I won't make a third one, but I'll just show you what the third one's gonna look like. So this, this, this will be fun. This is gonna be my third one, which is really simple. But just in case you wanted to see the fold again. I, oh, <laughs> right here. I'm gonna put my, so remember this is nine and, this is eight and a half, so it's as wide as your paper is, and then you're cutting it off at nine. So I'm using my eight and a half right here, and then I am going to score it at three and a half and seven. So what an easy measurements to remember, and these will just fit in a regular business envelope. So again, you know how I'm gonna just seal that up. This is the front, and then this is going to be the front of this card, and it just said, life is better with you. Now this is from the Trimming the Town DSP, so I could get a whole bunch of these out of one page. I just like this one with the skating rink. So here are three ideas that all open to a money card. And the video on top will show you a whole bunch more ideas to do with the slimline. Cards. Thanks for watching, Karen.